Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on where you live in the world. It's uh, evening here, as you can see the sun's going down. <laughs> so I made a video, I'm making a video now. I'll talk a little bit about my trip to America. That was supposed to be two weeks to a month and wound up being almost three months. If you want to know something about me or Rose, look at Rose's video. Don't look at other people's videos. Half the stuff they say is wrong. They said I wasn't coming back. They said I was on drugs. None of that was true. One guy said he helped Rose a lot. He didn't help Rose at all. He said he helped me a lot. He didn't help me at all. I don't know what that guy's problem is. Then somebody made a video and said we have a six hundred dollar, six hundred dollar uh, budget. How in the hell can we live in a place like this for six hundred dollars and have to buy food and pay electricity and all this stuff? A lot of these people, if you look at their other videos, they have no, no, uh, no views. But when they do something on the Campbells, their videos go up. So they just say whatever they feel like saying. But I'm back and I'm happy that I'm back. It's nice to be home. All my chronic stuff is better, but I'm still crippled and I'm still blind. And right now we have six kids here. And I, you know, I was just wondering, having a big family is kind of nice. It's a lot of laughter in the house and a lot of action going around in the house. So I always thought that maybe it would be a bad thing to have a big family. But everything else is good. I'm so happy to be back in the Philippines, sitting here in my yard. My family on Rosa's side I really enjoy. I was looking at some old videos before I came out here. And her potato salad is absolutely unbelievable. I couldn't believe she made it that good. First time she ever made American potato salad and some guy said American and German potato salad is different They're basically the same very few clouds in the sky. It was raining yesterday. It doesn't rain a lot here I guess you guys are wondering about me and Rose things are not perfect, but Relationships and marriage is never perfect. There's always problems. It's how you handle them some people handle them by saying, oh, I've had enough, I give up. That's not, when you get married, giving up is not, is not the answer. The answer is to work through the problems and try and make things better. I can't believe how many of you guys said, David, just give it up. That's crazy. As you can see, my arm still doesn't work. All the rehab in the world isn't going to make my arm or leg work again. I've done six months worth of rehab. Hasn't helped any. And you have to understand one thing. Just because you can do something one day doesn't mean you could do it the next day. Doesn't mean you're being lazy. It means you're disabled. A lot of you say, I don't care about my wife. I absolutely adore my wife. I've made some mistakes when I was gone. They weren't on purpose, but they were some dumb things that I did. I went to the casino. I shouldn't have gone to the casino. But I survived. I made it back. 
It took a little long. It took a few hospitals, but I made it back. I'm back here in the lovely Philippines again. Praise the Lord. One thing that happened while I was gone, I still believe in God again. I was going to go to church today, but I told Rose a little too late, so I didn't have she didn't have time to get me ready. So I guess I'll go next week. Say hi. Hi. Tell me your name. My name is Sophie Scarlett. And tell me how old you are. I am seven years old. Are you the biggest person in your class? Mm. Yep. Are you the smartest in your class? Mm. Nope. Who's the smartest? Smarter than you? Yep. Is he the teacher's helper too? What? Is it, does he help the teachers? No. So I guess you're the smartest then, huh? Yep. 